so this is the accountant's house and I'm going to show you really quick what this house looks like before and then I'm going to show you what I did with it uh, the garden is not that big uh, not in front of course but um, uh, you can see it a little better in the back I'm not as I always say not a garden person so I usually cut the grass and that's it maybe put some furniture out not that much some some flowers so I tend to do the things inside so let's open up uh, for me problem is all the houses look like they are abandoned and dirty and it, it's okay it's okay to wash the windows and, and, and floors in this case uh, I probably oh, I think I did I always always almost always take everything away I never save anything even if I can clean it up because I usually re remake everything here's the bathroom this uh, tile is really cool on the floor but i can't save it so it's gonna get rid of that um uh, the kitchen of course it looks awful and this is the bedroom and i have an idea that i'm gonna do with open this up and maybe uh make an ensuite i don't know let's see afterwards and this is the, an office let's go back in the kitchen it doesn't look good it's a little bit and then right outside in the garden and as you see you have plenty of room if you want to do something really cool in here it's not that many rooms so i probably use this for uh, like one or two person villa uh, not that much uh, however i'm gonna take a look inside here because when i was in here i saw outside I said this is too small and then I walked in this closet they've started to build closets but I was thinking it might have something hidden and yes it does so let's try to take this wall down uh, it doesn't work like this and let's see there's us there's some stairs and a space below I love these kind of things it's awesome so this is a space that i can do that i i'm gonna do something special in and well you could do whatever or an extra bedroom or something so not that special at all as as, as i said the furniture the pictures everything has got to go but uh, let's take a look what i did This is how it looks now and uh, I haven't done uh, that much to the garden. Let's take a look. This is just uh, the outside, just uh, hang around and uh, a pond. Let's take a look quickly at the back and you see I usually just cut the grass and maybe plant something, take some trees off and so this is it. I'm not going to do anything more with this house. Let's go inside. I do think it's very nice and neat that we you can use the doorbell. Uh, that's really good. Uh, so much fun. And yeah, you get right into the kitchen. Uh, it's a bit of, of a Nordic feel I have created here. And uh, you know, old versus new. I love that uh, in build things in not in the walls but um, and I do usually use the cupboards and stuff to make these islands uh, I wanted a really open open spaced dinner table dinner space room where you can hang around at the same time someone or you can make the food together uh, vice versa gonna close that one uh, you have people who can sit and read uh, at the same time or you can just watch TV like a great family room where everything in it yes we're gonna take a look at the bathroom later on just go back here and look I've been doing a guest toilet over here 
uh, it's the same colors because I love it um, as some storage c capacity here and of course the, the the simple room that you can have your washing machine and stuff uh, very close to the backyard and as I said before very simple backyard uh, let's go into office I haven't had a, I didn't want a door here it's gonna be open an open space I love this uh, stone walls I use it very often and I have the dog bed you know I like the wood and the stone and stuff like that and let's take a look downstairs what I did there as you can see I do and I did mix a lot of wood I, ha I love this medium dark wood out here and the gray ones uh, even with the stone but I can I usually do black uh, wood and gray pretty often of course the I can't change the stairs downstairs but I never mind it's a cellar and what did I do down here yeah of course I made a sauna I love saunas and in the Nordic we love saunas and like a hang around room you can just relax after you taking a sh taking a shower of course we have a shower here and watch some TV and the open fireplace take a beer in the fridge uh, you know take a cup of coffee whatever and just relax and then we you have the the bedroom we don't have many bedrooms in this house and i do think that i could have i could have made this room when we're standing into a bedroom or guest room or downstairs but actually i prefer more to have friends over so it's a more friends over house it could be a couple or a single man or a single gal i made this very bright uh, to the opposite of the other like wood kind of structures uh, but I love it and I do usually tend to have my own photographs this is not this is a, a painting from the program this is a photo of mine because I'm a photographer in real life so let's take a look at the bathroom so the bathroom actually has two doors so you can enter it like an ensuite even if it's not an ensuite but if you are two people in the house usually it's enough so you can have the doors open up into the kitchen too if you are in a hurry so very open spaced bath tub and shower facility because i do think that sometimes you want to have uh, go in the tub and sometimes you just want to shower so that's it very bright very not that a, a bit minimal but not that minimal and uh, yeah this is the accountant's house and you saw said you saw the you saw the before and now this is after thank you for watching